Hey, what's going on guys? It's Lil Bigness here and welcome back to part 6 of Mario Kart 8. In today's episode we will be tackling the Banana Cup. And here's our combination for today. We've got Ludwig with Mr. Scooty, the Sponge Wheels, and the Plane Glider. This is a combo I just chose off random and I don't even know the stats on it but let's look at them. Okay, we got good acceleration and handling. I'm happy. It's all pretty balanced, and I'm fine with that. Let's roll with it. Here's our banana cup. We've got GameCube, Dry Dry Desert, Sinesse Donut Plains 3, N64 Royal Raceway, I'd say the fan favorite track, and 3DS DK Jungle. So let's get this thing started. Oh, whoops. Actually, I clicked B. I'll get back to it, though. <laughs> Already failing. That's not a good sign. Hopefully we can improve. Come on, just load. I hate these load times. I, I hate any load times, let's be honest. But here we go. From Double Dash, we've got Dry Dry Desert. This is my former favorite Mario Kart until now. Mario Kart 8 is my new favorite. And um, I will still come back to Double Dash because Mario Kart 8 just barely beats it out. Just barely. Let's get that good start. There we go. Yes. If he didn't have that banana there, he would have been done. Oh no. Oh no. That didn't work out that well. But luckily we've got that good, uh, good acceleration. Oh man, I almost got another green snipe. trick off this. I love Ludwig's animations in this game. <laughs> They're awesome. Ludwig is my second favorite Koopling and um, I will be playing as my... Yeah, I'll be playing as my favorite Koopling next. And I uh, hope you guys agree with me on favorite Koopling because just he's the best. <laughs> we know that Ludwig's the second best. Ludwig seems to be the most popular though, in my opinion. I like Ludwig a lot though, so I can see. It's Ludwig von Beethoven. And speaking of Dry Dry Desert and Escape compared to Double Dash, I like what they did with it with this Oasis. This is really the highlight. I, 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 I just think it looks great. I love how you've got these sphinxes or whatever you want to call them in the background of the pyramids. But then, the one thing that I feel is really missing is the tornado. If you remember the tornado from Dry Dry Desert, that was awesome. See, it may have been a really hated track, but the tornado was just badass. <laughs> You just be running along and oh shit tornado! <laughs> I loved it. Okay, I, I I hate that turtle with this outside drifting vehicle. Which I actually like this vehicle for being outside drifting. It ain't that bad. Let's trick off that. Trick off that. Trick off that. Even though the water ones, I'm pretty sure slow you down. Oh, whoa, whoa. Yes, 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 another clutch moment. Sorry about that, everyone. I probably burned your ears there. But that was clutch. That was clutch. Let's go on to that next race. Look at it. Ludwig, Morton, and Roy are repping the top of the pack. And that's, I'm pretty sure, Pink Gold Peach, who nobody gives a fuck about. <laughs> I hate Pink Gold Peach, by the way. Here's Banana Cup. Oh. oh, this course isn't called Banana Cup. It's Sinesse Donut Plains 3. I like what they did with this track. I'm going to show off a little shortcut that I know of. No mushroom involved. <laughs> Here we go. Let's get that good start. Look at that red Yoshi over there with the toad. That's just awesome. Reminds me of Mario Superstar Baseball for some reason. 
Which is... Is it my favorite? Yeah, it's probably my favorite sports game in the Mario series, just saying. Probably because I'm just a huge baseball fan in general, but... Let's go. Oh, that was failed. You can trick off those. I might have shown it off in Moomin Meadows, but... Really, Roy? I'm your commander, damn it. You don't do that shit to me. There's Pink Gold Peach in the front. What a bitch. You're kidding me. Throw on that. Oh my god, why am I getting mauled by items? But yeah, here's the shortcut. I don't know why they didn't block this area off, but... You can just do that. There we go. Oh, god damn it. Using that drifting to my advantage. Okay, we gotta make a comeback this lap. Let's do it. Morton isn't too far ahead, so... We'll be able to. Oh. Damn it. That wasn't what I wanted. My oh my god! Why am I getting mauled by items? Everyone, I'm mauled by items. You know it, too. I was getting mauled by items this whole time. Okay. Oh, dang it. I tried to take the corner too tight, but... Fourth place. Okay, technically it's good, but it's disappointing for me, everyone. I should be showing you better. Let's get to the next race and just forget that one. <laughs> Here we go. Fan favorite track, in my opinion. N64 Royal Raceway. Whenever I go online, everybody's voting this track. Is it one of my favorite uh, retro tracks? No. It is not one of my favorite retro tracks. I'm actually not too big of a fan of it. Never was. Never will be. But I guess it's just your fan favorite track. I mean, I, I bet I would have liked it more if you would have been able to get in the Mario 64 castle, but no! Nintendo had to block that off! That would have been so awesome if you could go to the Mario 64 castle in HD. So, um, this is something I want to kind of discuss since E3 is coming up. Uh, what do you think Nintendo is going to do there? What I think is going to happen, they're going to announce a new HD port, and I think it's going to be Sunshine. That's one big prediction. I think I'm going to see a lot out of Zelda U, and most importantly, I think they're going to bring back Metroid. I, I, I'm feeling it. If there's any franchise that they'll bring back at this point, it's Metroid. They will probably bring back Star Fox and F-Zero another time, which I'd be excited for those. Like, I'd be really excited for those. <laughs> because actually, I've never played an F-Zero game, and I want to, I, I want to get into it. I'll probably purchase GX on my own time, but uh, that's probably the only one that I'll ever purchase outside of a possible new F-Zero game. Then here's the big discussion, Smash. We know they're going to do something with Smash. And what do I think is going to happen? I really don't know what newcomers we can see, but I, I'm feeling that if they do bring in a new newcomer, or like, if they bring in a third party newcomer, they will announce it at E3. The hype will be real there, and they will announce it. Let's look back. Look at Ludwig. <laughs> that grin. But, uh, who do I think is going to be the third party character? I have no idea. A lot of people would say Pac-Man. 
a lot of people would say Pac-Man. Call me crazy, but this could just be my me being biased towards Sonic, but I truly think that Shadow will be confirmed. Excuse me. <coughs> ah, sorry about that. But uh, let's get on to the next race. That one was easy. That's why I can commentate about Smash 4 the whole time and E3. But, um, I, I do think Shadow will be confirmed. And here's our last course of the cup. DK Jungle from the 3DS. Let's get this thing started. Okay. Got it race well here. This is coming from someone who's played Returns but hasn't beaten Returns. I, I really do like the game. That's probably going to be another co-op LP in the future. But I haven't beaten it yet, but I, I do really like the game. I, I actually, it, it was my first real Donkey Kong Country game. Because I wasn't around at the SNES times. So I never really got to play those. Oh, that was bad. Oh, in the gliding section and didn't really work out for the best there. Oh. Okay, here's our anti-gravity. Okay, and another gliding section. I've never gone around that thing. That's pretty cool. I just wanted to do it for fun there. Here's a little shortcut that you can do if you time your drift really well. Since I'm skilled at drifting, I can do it. And I've had practice with the shortcut, but... Okay. I want to throw this well. I don't want to just throw it. Crap. Bomb incoming! There we go. Oh, what? It didn't hit Morton. It did not hit Morton. Okay, I'm going to lay the bananas for him. That kind of didn't work out that well, but <laughs> I tried to do the trick on the last panel. Okay, okay. Let's pass Roy. We got to pass him. There we go. Oh, that was close. That was, that was close. You can get it again. Damn! Okay. Okay, there we go. Let's go up here. Yes! Got a pretty good lead. Or at least... Speaking of that good lead... <laughs> eh, whatever. I'm just having fun with this. Let's pass up Morton. Oh my god, that was... That was terrible. I should not be making that mistake. I guess we'll settle for a second. Now my question is, are we going to win the cup? Because I think Morton beat us by one. Ah, oh, damn it! Well, I lost the cup. <sighs> I'm sorry, guys. We'll view the results, though. really sorry about that. Should be better. I'm still blaming on the stupid items on Donut Plains 3. We're not looking at highlights when we lose. We don't deserve it. Silver looks pretty cool on that though. Oh, a new vehicle customization. I've been wanting the pipe frame for a while. And that's going to be it for this episode, everyone. Please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you in the Leaf Cup. Peace.